Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday, the 9th of November, was Patch Tuesday, where the latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 10 started rolling out KB5007186, and I received my update today on the 10th in my region of the world. Now, this latest update is rolling out for Windows 10 versions 2004, 20H2, and 21H1, and if you are running version 21H1, your OS build will now be 19043.1348. If you are running 20H2, that'll be 19042. And if you are running 2004, that'll be 19041. Now, Microsoft also recommends um, with the rollout of this update um, that if you are still running uh, Windows 10 version 2004, that you update to the latest version of Windows 10. As I have mentioned in previous videos, that Windows 10 version 2004 will reach its end of servicing and support on the 14th of December this year, 2021. Now, as always, if you'd like to see if you have the update, we just head to Settings, Update and Security. And because the Patch Tuesday updates are mandatory updates, this update will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And we just head over to View Update History, where the update will be listed under Quality Updates, Cumulative Update for Windows 10 version 21H1 KB5007186. Now, like all Patch Tuesday Cumulative Updates, this uh, latest update is mainly focused on security, and a total of 55 security flaws um, have been addressed uh, in this latest security update in the Windows 10 operating system. 49 of those flaws are important, six are zero-day vulnerabilities and two have already been exploited in the wild which means they are currently active so this latest patch tuesday security update is a very important um, security update for windows 10. now if you didn't install the uh, optional update which rolled out near the end of uh, last month um, october near the end of october last month for windows 10 that was KB5006738. If you didn't ins install that optional bug fix update, then those bug fixes and quality improvements will be rolled over into this update, which um, those quality improvements had fixes for subtitles in Windows 10, memory leaks, uh, the lock screen background, and there were numerous bug fixes. So all those fixes will be carried over into this update, KB5007186 as well. Now, when it comes to quality improvements, which rolled out, with this latest update. There's actually not much to report on. Microsoft just says that um, an issue has been addressed in which certain apps um, might have unexpected results when rendering some user interface elements or when drawing within the app that apparently has been fixed. And then um, the update also makes quality improvements to the servicing stack, which is the component that installs Windows updates. Now, for whatever reason, um, if you don't want to install uh, this latest update uh, through Windows Update or for, you know, th there are issues trying to get the update installed, you can always head over to the Microsoft Update Catalog. You just enter the KB number and you can go find your version of Windows 10 and just manually download and install the update. And this generally does help if for whatever reason you are having issues installing the update through Windows Update. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.